people love it. I mean, who doesn't love a cheese parade? Hi, my name is Peter Lovis, and I'm the proprietor of the Concord Cheese Shop. In this event, I'm the writer, I'm the director, I'm the producer, and I'm the star. I was pretty nervous, and I wasn't real sure how it was going to work. And now we had a plan A and a plan B and plan C, and we kind of merged them all together, and that's how it, that's how it came out. <laughs> We ordered it in October, if I'm not mistaken. Um, the 30 pound wheels that we get, we get every, we order, we can order Thursday for Friday. Uh, they're stocked regularly in the warehouse. It's in, they're out of Medford. Um, but something like this, where there's only, you know, 10 made a year. And this is probably the only one that came into the US, if I had to guess. We were not sure if we were going to do the thousand pound wheel. Um, we weren't sure logistically if it was possible. Um, so it was a very, very last minute. I mean, we had about 10 days to decide if we were going to bring it in or not. It was great. It was the 10th anniversary, the thousand pound wheel. We had a great crowd. The music was great. The echoing was great. My staff, I just like, they were perfect. They were just amazing. You know, people got the tattoos and the flags. I mean, we gave away, I don't know, 800, 1,000 Italian flags. And I don't have no idea how the tattoo, but I saw a lot of people with tattoos on their cheeks and their hands, so it was great. There's a whole proclamation, an official proclamation, that's um, given to us by the, 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 um, the town. So there, it's like a three-part. Uh, the town crier, there'll be Peter, and there'll be Davis from um, Italy that will take turns reading you know, parts of the proclamation. I have a proclamation! <laughs> from the Concord Select Board! From the Concord Select Board! Whereas, whereas, whereas the cheese shop of Concord, the cheese shop of Concord, How, how big and extravagant can we be as the Concord Cheese Shop? Um, you know, Peter especially, it's, you know, if, if everyone has 24-inch wreaths, he has to have 48-inch wreaths. Or, you know, it's, um, it's big, it's theatrical. You know, I think that's why we, we love our job. Uh, it's a cut-to-order shop. We interact with every single person individually from start to finish. You know, we, we, we select our cheese with them, we cut it, we wrap it, and we run the register, where it's the whole, the whole process. Ten years in now, people come in they'll, all year round, they'll ask for the parade cheese. Half of the consumers know it as the parade cheese, and the other half know it as Crucolo, which is fine. <laughs> They're buying it, so. Crucolo, it, Crucolo is Crucolo. It, I can, it can be described as like a, a young Asiago fresco. Um, in this size, we're not entirely sure. Flavor profile could be gamey, could be tangier, could be a little bit mushy. Who no, it's that's a it's a large format. As cheesemongers, the people that really understand and really get it, it's it's theater. It's it's fun. So why not a thousand pounds? A relating point, I think, for all of us is is the theater, the theatrical part of it. Um, we're storytellers. I, I found asking Peter questions. It's why this? Well, why not? Why a thousand pound wheel? Why not? I mean, we, I, it's something I do for the community. I do it for the for the town of Concord. I do it. You know, for my friends in, in Italy, it all came together. I can't believe we pulled it off, but we really, really did. <laughs>
We'll certainly do it again. It's a, it's a, it's a tradition in town, first Thursday of December, to have a party for you know, 2,000 people for a half hour. <laughs> it's, it's a lot of work. <laughs> I'm pretty spent. <laughs> I think I'll go back to the 400 pounders. So the 1,000 pounder was a bit of a, it was a push, you know, it was a real, it was a real work. It was, <laughs> it's a 1,000 pound wheel of cheese. <laughs>